Howdy, y'all. We're about to just dive right in. Mara's up there. Griffin's right here. You guys know the absolute vibes. Amber Lynn uploaded a video set 57 minutes ago titled Sushi, Pizza, and All the Calories. What I Ate Today, Episode 4. You know, she's making it real fucking hard to root for her. But... I don't know, I'm not rooting for her right now, I'm rooting for the version of her that could potentially be there. I don't know how to describe it, but this bitch is a mess, and we're about to get right into it, because what the fuck? Also, um, yes, if you didn't see my last video, this bed is different, taller, two things on here, moving to a new place, two bedrooms, new bed. We don't have anywhere to put it, so we just put it under our mattress. All right, we're getting right into this video, Susie, Pizza, and All the Calories, What Ate Today, Episode 4. It's like she loves setting herself up and makes it as hard as humanly fucking possible to root for her to do any better. That's okay. That's okay, because um, we're just gonna have to ride on this fucking roller coaster again. You know, we love a good cycle, right? Hello, welcome to day four Hi, of bitch. daily vlog slash what I ate today slash calories slash I don't know what this is, but welcome. I am trying to decide what I want to eat. So I'm on Uber and I figured I would vlog. This. She truly needs to go to the grocery store. She, I haven't seen her cook any of the food that she's ever bought in these grocery hauls. Have you guys, have you seen her cook any of the food? Because I have it. And I'm just like, hmm, what do I want to eat? What about the calories? What type of vibe am I feeling? And I just scroll and scroll and scroll. And then I look over at my girlfriend. What do you want to eat? What type of vibe are you feeling? And nine times out of ten, we kind of just go back and forth with that. I don't know what type of vibe. Do you know what type of vibe, babe? Homemade. Homemade. Slide like, for a minute there, I was looking at the pasta moments. And then I was like, oh, but Chinese sounds good. And now I just don't know. So I'm going to keep on scrolling. Oh, babe, that place that we had the other day, they have it here. The Maggiano's Italian Classics. Girl, I didn't. Okay, listen here. I'm sorry. Okay, I work at an Italian restaurant. Okay, like I work in I work in the kitchen. Okay, every day, pretty much. It doesn't travel well. Okay, like that's something you got to eat right there. So knowing that she will willingly eat Maggiano's as it's delivered to her is fucking me up. Just go there. Or make it at home. But they have it here. <laughs> you know you love me. No, absolutely not. Ooh, Baskin Robbins. Hi, ma'am. Do you guys like Cracker Barrel? I'll tell you one thing. Their chairs are tiny. So... Stop. I thought she was about to talk about the rocking chairs. He's like, fucking love those rocking chairs. And Nick's mom just gave me a rocking chair. Bro, immediately I was like, I feel like I'm a kid at Cracker Barrel again. I love a rocking chair. But no, of course they're just too tiny for her. What? They're not tiny. They're normal sized. A girl with my type of butt? No. Or a guy with my type of butt. Or a non-binary. You know. We can't sit there. It's not comfy. It's not fun. And the food is not worth it at all. So... No, oh, no, they try to send me to rehab. <laughs> sushi. How do you feel about sushi? Sushi's a winner. Sushi's a winner? Oh, we decided! <laughs> oh, wait, my weigh in. Okay, we'll get to tell it. We'll get to dip it. She thinks she is so fucking funny. The funniest part about her is how funny she thinks she is. We'll get to that later. Okay guys, so here is my meal. I got some edamame, which I'm so excited to eat. This is so good. It's like a garlic spicy seasoning that they put on top. And then here, this is a shrimp I've never had before. It's like sea bass and crab, um, peppers, and um, I think some avocado. And then here is just like my go-to, which is just like a crab mixture, which is so good. And we have soy sauce. And of course, my favorite, ginger. So we love a taste test and I have never had this sea bass sushi i don't know what's happening here so i'm gonna dip it in my soy sauce and we're gonna do a taste test i'm actually kind of nervous because i get nervous trying new sushis that's just me 
She gets nervous trying fucking everything. Oh my god. <laughs> Bitch. Oh my god. Uh... So let's go to that. Mm. That's pretty good. Um, I feel like there's something missing. Wow. This is a better view for you guys. No, it isn't. So crab, shrimp, uh, avocado, and then the sea bass is on top, but I already took a bite of it. Delicious. Mmm. This restaurant is the best restaurant for sushi. Anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna go enjoy my food. Oh my fucking god. Finished. Um, this is how much edamame I've left, how much edamame I did eat. I did finish the sushi wall, but I did not finish this one. This one was okay. I feel like I mainly ate it because like I was just like hungry, but the sushi that was here, that's like one of my favorites. And yes, it is 5.30 p.m. As you can see the time right here, I got a very, very, very late start to eating. I just wasn't really hungry after like the weekend of eating pretty bad if you Sorry, ask me weekend, so huh? yeah 600 calories and i feel pretty content so look at this cute little uh water situation type deal it's like a set that we got oh, we don't want to water <clears throat> some oh shit we haven't had an amazon unboxing in a while i guess she replaced amazon unboxings with the torrent holes i don't know we'll see Baby, what if I drank out of this? Could you slurp it, you think? There is no fucking way in hell right now that that is happening. I am in dis fucking belief right now. <gasps> She's not standing behind her like that. That's the craziest shit I've seen in my life. Wait, can we try it? Yeah. Is it just water? No, I'm scared. I think we're too weird. All right, you guys. Next round of events. We have a torrid moment. So this is a shirt, which is a size six. A lot of people ask, why do you say size six instead of like six X? It's like a dusty pink. It's just like a tank top situation type deal. Every time she says situation type deal, I, use, I lose a year of my life. Like, I'm not even kidding. All right, let's try it on. Oh, this is definitely nice and airy for the summer. It's super thin. And like I said, it does look see-through. For some reason, I thought it was gonna be too small on me, but it's not, <laughs> it's pretty loose. A lot of people also ask why I pluck insecurities, honey. I can be the skinniest person in the world, I'm still. It's literally comparing yourself to a skinny person all the time. Bitch, shut the fuck up. Just say it's an insecurity, okay? That's fine. You don't have to say other people would also have or that you would have it if this were the case. Like, just say it's an insecurity and move on. Stop trying to justify everything by saying somebody else has the problem, okay? Other people have murdered people. Are you gonna be like, it's okay that I do it because other people have done it. Shut the fuck up, bitch. All right, sorry, that was insane, okay. Do this bit, like, it's just an insecure little tick that I do. So this is what it looks like up close. There's like a little lace moment down here. I don't know, I mean, it's plain jeans, whatever. So yeah, this is just like a low key tank top that I'd probably just wear like a black cardigan with, you know? I'm gonna give this like a four out of 10. I kinda, eh, doesn't do anything for me. Okay, you guys, it is time for my next meal. So this meal is 600 calories. And I am so pumped, so hungry. <sighs> I, I know a lot of you ask, like, how's your mom doing? Phenomenal, she's doing amazing. That's good to know. Um, this year, actually, November 1st, will be seven years that she is clean and sober. Hell yeah. <sighs> I never would've thunk Hi it. For all right, now, celebratory bite for her. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Anyways, bourbon chicken. Have you guys ever had it? It's amazing. And bad judgment, I had three slices of pepperoni pizza for 690 and three servings of baked cheddar and sour cream chips. My weight today was 495.2. So after this weekend, there was definitely a game. Hi, everybody. She knows I got ice cream. She's obsessed with ice cream. But this is the last thing I'm having. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs>
Okay, so when I showed you guys this halo top, I noticed this right here. It says now creamier. And in my head I was like, I've been addicted to these. And they have never said that before. So in my head I was like, oh that's cool. So it's gonna like be just as great, just creamier. Like everyone loves a creamy moment. Okay, that sounded weird. <laughs> but you guys, no. I'm very sad. Um, you know, here's me relating to Amber Lynn again, our girl. I remember when they did this with Honey Nut Cheerios, not Honey Nut Cheerios, when they did this with Honeycomb, and then they had to go back to the, the original recipe because the new recipe they made was fucking disgusting. I feel like I might know what she's saying because like usually creamier things like doesn't always mean. But like, I don't want to steer you guys wrong. I never want to. So I'm letting you know this one's not as good. Um, and if you want to play a little game, get one with this and then get one without it. Try it. And let me know which one you prefer because this ain't it, sis. While we're here and we're sad about it, um, let me tell you how many steps I took, how many calories, and we are gonna just end the night. Okay. Calorie wise, oh honey, 2,610. That's less than yesterday. Okay. That's not happening again tomorrow. No, it's not. Sure, Jan. As for steps, um, I didn't really try. <laughs> Whoopsies. Um, that's also not happening again tomorrow. Sure, Jan. Friday through Sunday, I become a different person. I forget about routine. I forget about what. I thought that her, Jade, you're supposed to be motivating her. She said that she's never felt more motivated in her life than because of her Jade. Yeah, she's still doing the same shit, and Jade's kind of enabling it. So, what's going on, Hamberlin? Um, but for steps, I only did 2,138. That's horrible. Tomorrow, I want to do at least 4,500, I'm thinking. I know a lot of people think I'm faking seeing a psychologist. I don't understand why. I think that's a very odd thing to fake. Um, I might want to start being like more open and talking more about it, but it is supposed to be just like a personal thing I don't really know how else to prove that to you guys. It's kind of weird Um, I don't know why anyone would lie about something like that. Anyways, I'm rambling. I'm gonna go and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye You're right Amber. Why the fuck would anybody lie about that? Why would anybody lie about a lot of the shit that you lie about? Um, yeah, that was crazy. Um, that was 14 minutes and somehow felt like two. So, but I've never been more shocked by a video in my life. She just shocked me over and over and over and over again. So let me know what you guys think down below. That's funny as fuck. Um, I always have important links down below and I'm about to head the fuck out because I want to go get some Brazilian street food. All right, bye guys.